Hi everybody, welcome back to Jen's Pens. I wanted to show you tonight how to fill up an in ink converter without actually dipping the nib in the feed. I needed to refill my Jen Shark pen. I always like to put the same ink back in. This is the Diamine Lilac Satin. It is just gorgeous. It goes down almost like a violet purple, but that silver shimmer in it turns it into this nice, soft little lilac. It's a very sweet color. For some reason, it works fabulously in this shark pen, and it matches, so I can't get any better than that. Usually, I do fill it from the nib, but I just wanted to do a quick video to show you how to do that in case you wanted to do it with a syringe. Um, so I, I also wanted to show off this very beautiful ink. Oh, it is so pretty. You can see all the silver shimmer there that has settled on the side of the bottle. So I'm just gonna shake it up. Um, I know some people say not to shake the ink, but by and large, I have not had any problems with shaking ink. And I would rather the shimmer be where it's supposed to be than not be in all of the ink. So what I'm going to do, I have my little blunt tip syringe here. I got this from Goulet Pens as well. seems like everything I got from them because they're awesome. So <laughs> I got that. What I'm going to do is I am going to ink this up. Let me see if I can do this a little easier for you guys. There we go. So I'm going to ink it up about one milliliter because that is what most converters can take from what I have experienced. I'm not going to try to put any more in at this point. So now I have the ink in my syringe. I'm going to zoom in a little bit now. Sorry for the bouncy camera. So now I'm going to pull my converter all the way up to the top and then I'm going to put the blunt tip needle in the end of the converter. I'm just going to gently and slowly push the ink in and yeah it went almost right to one. This also helps you get a really good fill too. So now that I have the ink in there what I'm going to do, I should have taken this apart first, <laughs> is I am going to, well I guess the lid doesn't have to come off. This is just a converter that pushes in. It's not a screw one, but I do rotate it a little bit just to make sure it's good and in there. And then your pen is filled and there's no mess around the nib. Now you are going to have to wait a little bit for the ink to come down through the nib and feed. If you want to dip it in the meantime, that's fine. But I just thought it would be nice to show you how to fill any uh, converter or anything with an ink syringe uh, so you can do it without making a mess or if you want to refill a cartridge it, it works the exact same way and I found that they usually take about one milliliter as well so if you want if you have a cartridge and you're out of ink or you don't want to use that color sometimes I'll just take a black cartridge that comes with a pen if it doesn't come with a converter I will empty the cartridge and fill it with whatever ink I want with a syringe and we're all good to go. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.